everybody! Today I am filming in my car because um, I have a busy day and I'm not sure if I'll be able to film this later. So I figured while it's on my mind and in my brain, I should uh, film it now. So I apologize in advance if the sound quality is kind of bad or the video quality is kind of bad. Um, but yeah, today I wanted to talk about judgment. Um, I mean judging other people, judging yourself, um, just judgment in general. Um, because that's a big one for me, that's uh, something for me that I do a lot, and not just to other people, but to myself too. And I know that that's really damaging um, to judge yourself and judge your feelings. For instance, a lot of the judging that I do about myself is like, oh, I'm not making enough money. That's pathetic. I'm 25 years old. I should be doing better. Why am I not doing better? That's stupid. Then I also judge my feelings about stuff like that. So maybe I feel that way and I judge myself for not being where I want to be, but then I also will judge myself for judging myself. So then I start judging my feelings and my emotions. Like, well, why, why do you feel that way? That's dumb. That's, you know, ridiculous. You shouldn't be feeling that way. Lots of shoulda, coulda, wouldas, lots of that stuff. Um, and it's just damaging because we have to validate our feelings. Even if, let's say, my feelings are coming out of nowhere and they're not based in any fact, they're not rational, I still have to respect them and I have to acknowledge them and I can't just think I'm dumb for feeling them because thinking I'm dumb for feeling my feelings does nothing to benefit me at all. In reality, it just makes me worse and, you know, then it just becomes this vicious cycle of judgment and feeling like crap and, yeah, so that's something that I like to think about a lot because I'm constantly questioning my feelings and uh, constantly judging myself for having totally normal, you know, reactions to disappointment or reactions to fear and anger and all emotions are valid whether they make sense or not because feelings in and of themselves, emotions, emotional mind is irrational. It doesn't think about the facts. It focuses only on how you feel. So there's no point in judging it. Their feelings, their emotions, we have them and there's nothing we can do about that. As far as judging other people, I find myself doing that a lot when I'm afraid too. Um, fear for me is like a huge obstacle that I have to get through. It's like one of my main issues, one of my, the main things in my life that makes it hard for me to progress and, and move forward and make friends and fall in love and it's, yeah, it's the biggest thing for me. So like, for example, a girl walks by and she's wearing a skimpy dress and I might judge her like, oh, that's that's ridiculous, why is she wearing that short dress? Ew, she's tr trying to, you know, show off for people and blah, 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 blah. Realistically, that judgment of her, it has nothing to do with her, it has to do with me and my fear and my, me feeling like I'm not good enough for a man if I, unless I dress like that, for instance. Um, or that those kind of girls are gonna give other women a bad name and all men are then gonna think that we have to wear skimpy dresses and we have to um, flaunt our bodies and that's the only way that they'll think we're attractive. So that's a fear and that judgment that I've placed on her only has to do with my own fear and my own thoughts and yeah, it has no bearing on her or what she did or what she's wearing or nothing. So I think about that a lot now. Um, yeah, or where I judge, you know, someone's opinion. Like, oh, that's so dumb. Why are they thinking that way? In reality, I'm just afraid too, because if somebody thinks differently, it's going to cause conflict or um, maybe something will happen that is outside of my comfort zone. Um, yeah, I think we all just judge what we don't know and what we don't understand because of our own biases and our own fear. And we don't like, like the human brain does not like to not know what's going on. We want to know everything about everything. We want to put, you know, piece 
together about everything we want to know. So for me, my fear puts together pieces that don't exist and they come out in, in judgment, in ways of judging people or, yeah, I guess that's the best way to put it. So judging is bad, evaluating is fine, evaluating a certain, you know, situation or a certain person, evaluating them is fine, judging them is based merely and solely on our own thoughts and ideas and our own limitations and our own biases and our own stuff. Evaluation focuses only on the facts. So I could have evaluated that girl and said, oh, that dress, I personally wouldn't wear it, but she's wearing that dress. She looks nice in it. Those are the facts. It ends there. I'm placing the emotions on them. She's not doing anything to elicit my emotions. I'm placing my emotions on what she's wearing, which is really ridiculous when you pull it apart like that. Um, so yeah, that was just what was on my mind today. And now I'm going to go into this audition and then I'm going to work tonight. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.